Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Nah, don't worry about them, nah. Bruv, we're like nine months in now. Do you think any normal people are left? No one normal's watching this, bruv, trust me. They'll be fine. They've probably had it all before. Patrick, come on. Oh, all right, I'll turn it off. I'll, no, I'll turn it off, I'll turn it off. What's going on people? See Crash is back. Review today. Kicks are in. Got them early. Oh yeah, I got them early, alright. Shouts to Korean sneakers once again. Here we go. Reviewing on feet. Jordan 6. Can't mind. Let's go. So yeah, Jordan 6, can't mind. Came out a week earlier in Korean sneakers again. Saw it on there. Thought I'd have a go. Entered the draw. Boosh! Won the draw, first time ever. I've got shoes off sneakers before, but not. I've never won a draw. Madness. I love this shoe as well. Should we get into it, yeah? I'll stop babbling. Let's do it. Thanks, Nike. This box is massive as well. I don't know, maybe there's three shoes in here. Put me three shoes in there, maybe, you never know. Receipt. Won't be needing that, again. Bye bye. So yeah, we're seeing this for the first time, me and you. Let's do this. Have I got a pink midsole though? Some people have been getting pink midsoles, haven't they? I don't want one of them. Let's hope that's not in here. Are you ready? I am. Oh my God. Oh, incredible. Oh my God. Boom. Jordan 6, come on, there we go people, the OG in its original form, 1991, the Jordan 6, come on, straight off the bat, looking really nice, you know, can't see any pinkness on here, no flaws, no strawberry milkshake, come on, for me, thank God, oh, it's just lovely man, you know, I love 6s, I do, I ain't got loads of them, I've got the maroons, which are nicely yellowing in the background, I've got the infrareds, and I've got these joints, but... I'm really happy to add these to collection. These came out 2014 as well, they retro again. I wanted them then, to be honest, but I think a Jordan 1 Carman came out at the same time. Anyone in the comments below, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. I was gonna get them, I was gonna pull the trigger, but you know, I didn't have my own business then. I couldn't really buy sneakers that much. When I did, my wife was always giving me crap, do you know, which is rightly so. I didn't really have the money to just buy shoes whenever I want. Now she's a bit more lenient. This time I could pull the trigger on these joints, and I am so happy to have these in the collection. This is a madness. Right. Let's start with your midsole. Your midsole's black with hints of white as well and also iciness. There's iciness around the old visible air unit as well. Now the problem with the icy bottoms is it might yellow like this, but I mean people are loving the vintage vibe these days, aren't they? It seems people like that vintage more. So if you want anyone out there who wants a vintage vibe, I will happily store your shoes in my closet, let them yellow in there, you pay me a nominal fee. Get back to me if you want it. I mean, I do like the iciness, but I am aware, well aware, that it's going to turn yellow soon. But I don't mind, even when it yellows a bit, I don't mind that. I don't mind the look of that, do you know what I mean? So, I'm happy for it to go yellow. On the outsole, you've got your red Jumpman, you've got your hints of ice everywhere, your icy bottom, and then you've got your white as well. So, white, icy blue, and red on your outsole. On the back of the shoe... This is what people came for, innit? 1991, OG style. Nike Air on the back, stitched in. Looks really, really nice. And your spoiler is beautiful as well. You've got your red and black spoiler on the back as well. Old sports car vibes for MJ. Now, the leather. The leather is quite stiff, I'm not gonna lie. Straight, even from first look, I can see. The leather's quite stiff, but I think that might be because in 1991, the leather was quite stiff as well. Maybe they're just taking it all the way back with the OG vibes. This looks very true to form. And maybe that's what they were doing. So they wanted a bit more of a stiff leather. You've got your white leather on the outside, like I say, it's very stiff. And then you've got your new book in carmine red on your paneling and also on your toe box. You've got your white laces and then you've got your jump man in the middle there in red and black. 
You've also got your lace lock with Nike on it. Usually it's got the jump man if it's not OG because this one is true to form. It's got the old Nike on there. And you've got your tongue as well. Now, the tongue's quite high. Because it's folded in here, I've not even taken it out. It doesn't look that high, but it is quite high. It does go up quite high. The old black Jordan Nike tongue. Hirachi style, isn't it? Hirachi style. Your insole is black and it's got Nike Air in white on it. And you've also got black all the way around your sock line there. So it's not going to get that dirty, which is good if it was a white sock line and we're in trouble, aren't we? But this is just looking proper, proper wavy. I can't wait to put these on feet and show you these. The new book's quite nice and soft to touch, you know? And I do love the Carman hits, but the white leather is a bit, it is a bit stiff. But as I say, maybe that's the thing. Maybe that's the look they were going for. If you can get your hand on these, I would highly recommend it. They come out on Saturday in America and in the UK. Luckily for us, we got them like six days early in Korea. Touch for us, eh? Patrick, ratings, let's have it, bruv. And don't be stingy. You know what we feel about these. These are the ones. Tell it true. Tell it true, Patrick. See, I might have even gone nine and a half. I might have gone nine and a half for these joints because they're such a classic shoe all the way back. But okay, I'll take a nine. Nine out of ten for the Jordan 6 Carmine. Thank you for watching, everybody. Thanks for watching our Jordan 6 Carmine review. I hope you can get these this weekend if you're after them. Thank you for always supporting. Please like, please subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram if you haven't already. I'm going to show you these on feet, these Carmines. I'm going to enjoy putting these on my little trotters. I will tell you that much. Thank you. Take it easy. I'll be back soon. I was supposed to have some Valentine's Day tips this weekend, you know. Me and Patrick, we're going to show you how to find some love if you're single out there. I couldn't do it because I got these. You know what I mean? These are shoes of riff, innit? But hopefully, I'll be back next week with some love tips for you. If you're single after Valentine's Day, never fear. Adish is here, and I will show you the way. Maybe. Take it easy, everyone. Be safe. Be happy. <laughs> From me and the big dog. We're out.